In the next 15 minutes, I'm going to show you how you can build your own AI appointment booking bot for Instagram, Facebook, SMS, WhatsApp, whatever platform you want, you can pretty much do it. And no joke, my 10 year old cousin could probably build this because I wanted to create a video that is super simple and easy that anyone can build in less than 10, 15 minutes. So without further ado, let's get into this. Now, first of all, I just wanna say thank you for 6,000 subscribers. Um, and in return, I'm going to be uploading every other day on this channel. So I've got some crazy videos planned. You do not wanna miss it, but yeah, let's get into this. So you'd wanna to go to automation inside your high level sub accounts. Now, what you would want to do, right, is let me make myself a bit smaller. You'd want to create a workflow. Now, I recommend starting from scratch. Um, just because it's a bit easier and you can you know, do it as I'm showing you right now. So I've already built it. So what I would do is I'd go back, or if I can't go back, I'd go here and I would basically go here. So let me show you what it looks like in, in full so I can walk you through it. So first of all, right, you're going to need a trigger. Now, a trigger can be quite literally anything but for the, in this case it's going to be customer replied so when i get a dm on instagram and if you haven't already seen my instagram then what you're doing you should follow it but whenever i get a dm on instagram with the word grow i'm going to run this bot right that it acts as a trigger and then it starts the ai appointment booking bot which is pretty cool so what would happen right is it would wait so Whenever someone DM me, it would wait one minute. Now, the reason we have it set up for a minute is because you don't want to reply instantly because then you can sort of tell that it's a bot. So I just space it out for one minute as a time delay. And then I would send the uh, Instagram message, which is basically something like, uh, I got you, I'll drop it below. Thanks for reaching out. Here's the link you're looking for. So it's a free lead magnet. You give them the actual lead magnet and then you would basically want to wait. So you would basically wait for contact reply. So once the lead actually replies, then you're going to send them an Instagram DM. Now, you would basically want to put a condition. So this is uh, if else. So how you would do this is you would basically go to the add button, you would click if else, and then what you'd want to do is you want to create a condition. So if the lead replied equals true, so if the actual uh, lead you know, replies to the Instagram message you sent up here with the free lead magnet saying thank you or whatever they say, it's then going to take them through this AI chat GPT appointment booking bot. But if they don't respond, it's going to send a message in 24 hours. So it'll wait 24 hours and then it's going to send an Instagram DM saying, hey bro, did you get a chance to check out the free training? Or hey John, did you get a chance to check out the free whatever you sell? or you're giving as a free lead magnet. Um, and then obviously it would wait. So wait two days. You can obviously change this to 24 hours, 10 hours, five hours, whatever you want. Um, and then it would be a condition. So did they respond to this message? If they didn't, then um, you could either just do it yourself or you could, you get the point, right? You could basically um, add chat GPT here. If we find GPT, uh, where's, where's it gone? Um, I think if we can just search it, that would probably be way easier. You can basically search and you can say, the lead has not responded, write a gentle follow-up that is less than 20 words, trying to get them to watch or reply to the last message. Um, but yeah, then if they do respond, it's basically going to send them back up to here. So here, right, we've said to ChatGPT that you are an appointment setter on Instagram. The lead has reached out and you've given the free lead magnet. So you're basically giving ChatGPT um, context around where, where they are in the, um, in the pipeline. So your job is to find, uh, have a friendly conversation and ask simple questions that I will give you below. So I recommend giving them the questions, otherwise you know, the, it could be whatever they want or whatever the prompt uh, yeah, does basically. So Keep your response to less than 18 words and try to give them, uh, try to get them on a meeting. Um, and then obviously you put your calendar link. And if you want to do that, you can basically go here, calendar, put whatever you want. Um, and then you'd say, for example, once they respond to the free league magnet, you would say something like, of course, are you working towards any goals right now? And you can put the temperature to free. This basically means that zero, it says here that um, 
it makes the output more random while like closer to zero so 0 0.2 will make it more focused and deterministic so you could go for five i think that's pretty reasonable um, and then you'd basically want to put the chat gpt1 response so you'd go here you'd go to chat gpt and you'd put one and then click response and boom um, it's then going to actually send a message to them so then it'll do the same thing it'll wait 24 hours um, and if they responded so if the lead responded you would basically say to chat gpt the lead has responded again now you're going to process the um, answer and ask another qualifying question for example that's dope how many clients do you have currently or you can change this and once again set the temperature to what style um, or what tonality you want chat gpt to be so if they didn't respond you could basically say to chat gpt the lead hasn't responded so you're going to send a funny follow-up um, message that's less than two sentences to get them back into the conversation which is the goal so you'd put you'd go here you would go custom values chat gpt and then click free as that's the one we put here whereas for here we would basically want chat gpt to response um, and so forth and so forth you could build this way more in depth where it constantly has it so it's like a never ending ai appointment booking bot i guess and obviously the more or the more in depth you give the prompt the better answers chat gpt is going to have now that is a basic overview of how this works so you get traffic to your instagram page um and if you haven't followed me on instagram i put daily updates on there about my life just more free value i guess um but you would get people onto your page um, whether it's ads, whether it's organic content, um, you know, just get lead flow basically. Get people to DM you a keyword for a free lead magnet. It's the cheapest form, it's the cheapest CPA, cost per acquisition um, or cost per lead is a free lead magnet, free training or free PDF. Um, you can get creative with that. Um, and then you basically just follow this workflow um, step by step, like what I've showed you. Really simple. Um, and you can also, um, what I do sometimes, right, is let me try and find an example. Uh, let's do, I think this one, for example. I don't know if people commented, but you'd basically, I think it was, I'm trying to think which video it was. Maybe I think this one got 17 comments where people commented the word doc, which I recommend putting in your organic content because not only will, if you get them to comment, um, the word right for whatever free lead magnet not only are you going to boost the post so not only is the post gonna or the reel reach more people because the engagement is higher it's also going to give you a keyword in which then you can run an automation on another software like many chat um, i don't think go high level as of now can can do this but there's plenty of other softwares like many chat voice flow that can basically message people who comment on your on your post um and like follow you and stuff. But I just wanted to give you a really simple one of how to do this. And this also works for Facebook or WhatsApp. If you do the exact same thing, you get people to comment um, or send you a DM on yeah, Facebook, WhatsApp, SMS, you can do the same thing. And this is how you would do it. Now for SMS, I think it can get quite expensive. I think it's 0.5p, uh, so five cent per time it asks ChatGPT um, or you know, does the prompt, whereas you can connect, um, and if you want the latest version of ChatGPT, so ChatGPT4, then what you would have to do is you would have to go onto OpenAI, um, find out your API key, use Zapier or Zapier, however when you say it, um, and basically connect it to Go High Level if you want the latest ChatGPT, but I found that this is good enough, to be honest. Um, you can obviously make this more in depth, but I kind of wanted to give you a simple overview of how this works, so you can just replicate it. Um, if you want Go High Level, I'll put a link in the description. You can get 14 days completely free, test it out, have some fun. Um, you can basically do everything in your agency from high level. Like you can cold call, email, SMS, DMs, like you name it, you can do. Um, and I just use it as a CRM, so for managing clients as well. But yeah, I'll leave a link in the description if you want Go High Level. Um, 14 days free email as well. But yeah, other than that, follow me on Instagram and subscribe because I've got some banging content coming. And if you subscribe and the more subscribers I get, the more content or the more value I'm going to put on this channel. So right now, I think we've got about 6K subs, depending on when you're watching this. Um, I'm currently uploading every other day, putting as much free value to help as many of you guys 
uh, with growing an agency, coaching, whatever you sell um, as possible. So yeah, hit the subscribe button, like and comment if you want similar videos to this. And yeah, take care and have a wonderful day.